Got some wild animals as well. Some more cats. My sensors read a mineral not found in my database, Pathfinder. That's something we can scan for Chief Lucan? It would improve his geophysics VI considerably. Okay, apparently it's here. Get that. And that's this has gotta be it that we gotta scan. Yeah, how many materials we gotta scan? We gotta scan a shitload. It's gonna be too much. Our fucking supply is going our life support is going down by quite a bit. Gotta be careful here. Yeah, we got a lot to shit to do here. Uh well I and mean, that I think it's just our time just to explore the map really. Got some more kits. No. Off you go. What you going buddy? Hey. Woo! Let's go baby. Careful this I don't think Neil. Yeah, descend it. Got one now. Woo! Let's go, baby. Ow. I don't like those ones. Kill that one. Woo! Whoa, there's still more. Nope. Off we go. <laughs> Okay. There are some heat. Uh, there are some heating stuff here, so let's get that. So we recharge our life support. I'm not sure what the hell is going on with my hood. It must be somebody using some sort of special ability. I'm reading a temperature decrease. Uh, let's see if we can find something here. Uh, maybe we will find something useful, or maybe just a cat checkpoint we could hit. Yeah, seems about just about it. Slam! Look how good this game looks, though. Looks so good. Hoping a new Mass Effect game that comes out in the so on future will be, you know, looking this good. Cause I'll give credit to Andromeda. This game looks just looks fantastic. All right, well, I guess we're heading to uh, Hajawa onto the front lines. Don't mind me if I do, Mr. Colossal Rapper Man. Urgh! Wow, that didn't do shit. <laughs> hey, Jal. You smell really nice. Like, not just now. Always. Thank you. I like to. But I take pride in all aspects of my person. I like to smell nice. Well, I think it's great. Where do you get it? I make it. Is tinkering with alcohols and plant essences that different from explosives? Yeah, kinda. Huh. Hey. Oh, that's. So here's one of the peak and we got her. Mess with. All right, Let's see what we can do with this container. I think that's all. I think that's all there is. All right, so this is where we're supposed to head to. Oh, there's another resistance camp here. Ah, ah. Another resistance camp here. We gotta head to. Ijara is a research station, mostly focusing on Vold's geology. Let's see if someone here needs help. Okay, so it's mostly a research uh, station. They got some military personnel, but not much. Uh, Don't think that ice is for slushies. Bad weather for it. Someone around here probably knows what that ice is for. I hear the researchers here drill into the ice in order to study it. Alright, let's head inside. See who needs some help. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Don't mind me if I scan this stuff. <laughs> Try asking Armroll about it. Alright, let's talk to the researchers see if they need any assistance. Someone said they saw an alien arrive at the resistance base. Now here you are. Oh, I wish I could talk. I gotta get this sky cursed piece of junk working. It's been picking up weird interference for days. I can't transmit data to our colleagues in Talara. Okay, uh, can I help? Is there something I can do? Maybe. I didn't think you'd be familiar with our machines. Oh, I need to take a break before I kill someone. If you want, feel free to poke around. 
Okay. Examine the equipment, which I already did. Okay, we gotta use the console. High powered communications array. Most likely for planet wide communications. Makes sense. Anything on that interference the researcher talked about? I am detecting a signal. It is faint, but this equipment is sensitive. Get the heck out of my face. I also observe a regular pattern in this emitted signal. It may be artificial. You don't mean cat? Are you saying the cat are disrupting our comms? We must look into this. Okay, we're gonna speak to Skeet, which might be over here. Right, there you we are. Just attack an entire cat That's base. the guy we gotta talk. You're that alien people have been talking about. Some say we can't trust you, but if you're here to fight Cat, that's good enough for me. Thanks, I guess. I appreciate the vote of confidence. Cat kill people. They take our families and we never see them again. Anyone who fights against that has to be better than them. So, will you fight them? I know the location of the labor camp where they took my uncle. Labor camp? What's a Cat labor camp for? Different things. They put people in cages there. Sometimes they make them work. Sometimes they collect Angara, and once they have enough, they move them. And sometimes they just kill them. My father died that way. That's awful. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Make sure I don't lose more family. Yeah, we can definitely help. I'll get your uncle. Here's the nav point of the labor camp. Please hurry. Nilj may not have much time. Okay, so we gotta hit, hit the labor camp for the ongoing that have been taken by the kit. Let's see if anybody else here needs some assistance as well. Whoa. Can we scan this ice? Yes, we can. Ice block. Scan that away. Got some containers. Alright, let's go in here. Don't mind me. Hello. We could talk to these people here for probably additional side mission. Lots of people with names here. Uh, we'll have to talk to these people here for additional side mission. Let's see, what does this lead to? Oop. Well, well, well. Don't mind if I do. Sitting in the sub behind here? Nope. Thought it was. Man, look at that reflection though. It looks amazing. Go to here though. Yep, figures. Always good to explore. I'd like to hide some stuff around. Get that. Look at that jump. Can we talk to you, the lookouts here? Hey, what's up, guys? Alright, well, let's talk to the scientists down there that might need our help on something, so. We're gonna see if they need our help or not, or they might ignore us. We're gonna find out right now. Let's talk to the. Ah, the alien. We heard reports. Can't imagine anything here interests you. Science interests me. Why not? I heard this was a research station. I'm always interested in exploratory science. I wasn't expecting that. I never heard that about you. Now, is there anything you need from me? Uh, I just talk to I won't disturb your work. Only the cat showed us the same courtesy. Okay, I didn't mean to do that, but let's talk to this guy here. You, Dinor. Can't really talk to him. There we go. The numbers check out. I, I don't know what else I can do to strengthen my argument. I. Oh, hello. You're that rider alien everyone's talking about. Mm hmm. That's me. Mm hmm. Uh, ice talkers, yeah. Let's ask them about the ice talker. I was gonna ask her later about that, but accidentally, you know, click on the let's you no, know, let's go essentially. You said something about ice talkers. What are those? Oh, that's something of a joke between me, journalists, and everyone who went to school with us in Australia. One of our classmates was at an old archaeological dig and thought he heard a voice through the ice. Two months later, another group claimed they heard the same thing, an angry voice. What was it? Too much Malay. That's what journalist says. Now it's become something of a joke between us. Okay, interesting. Hey. Yeah, I'm pretty sure none of these people got any sort of mission. Maybe the merchants up here might have something, or this guy here, or lady. This isn't Haval. 
If you spend too long out there in the dark, you'll get weak, sick, or worse. It's bad. I get it. How do I stay alive? The moment you see sunlight, break cover. Soak up all the rays you can. I'll be a target. Not for long. You'll get a lot from just five minutes of exposure. After that, get back undercover. The human is listening to us. You here to learn survival tips from old Percy? Uh, light. Let's ask her about that. Sun? We draw nourishment from solar radiation. Keeps us sharp. Even healed minor injuries. But we have to keep out of sight, or the cat will spot us. I see. Any advice of survival? You sound like an expert, and I'd like to survive. What I can teach wouldn't help. Different biology. Your body can't store a charge. Well, that's something I don't have. Sadly, <laughs> sickness. If you go too long without sunlight, do you get sick? Lack of regular exposure puts our bodies under stress. Too much of that, and we're no use to anyone. Have to keep my strength up for the resistance. How much uh, did he sun power? I'm ready to go, Pussy. Need that solar radiation. Not so fast. You still don't know how to read a weather pattern. Okay. What about the merchants here? Do they got any additional missions for me to do? Or stuff to sell? Let's talk to this guy here. He has a name. Uh, there was an alien lurking about the place. That would be me! Don't try to start something. We're all combat trained by the resistance and prepared to die. And try not to disturb our data probes. Our research is valuable, though it may not mean much to you. Scientists out here. It takes guts to be crazy out here alone. They only send scientists who can handle themselves in a fight. Since the resistance can't always protect us, we protect ourselves. Okay, interesting. Uh, let's ask about himself. Are you in charge here? Lead researcher. Worked as a seismologist on Aya before I volunteered for Hijara. You volunteered? We all did. Aya is fine, but all that green gets boring. I can't speak for the rest, but I came here for the adventure. So far, Vault has lived up to my expectations. Always a new mountain to scale. Tell me about the station. How long has the station been around? It's a good Only question. a few years. This used to be Ket territory before the Resistance pushed them out. We've discovered a wealth of resources the Ket protected out here. Metals, minerals. Even a new species of edible cold weather fungus. Ooh. All that was hidden under Nice. <gasps> and more. We've only scratched the surface. Okay, that's all for now. I'll come back if I need anything. I'll be here. Okay, so we know he's a lead researcher. Do you sell stuff? Well, I haven't seen many of I hope you do. Here, but I've heard lots about the Pathfinder from my friends on Aya. All good things, I hope. So far. Uh, how's business? <laughs> do you get much business out here? I do all right. The trick is to not stay in one place too long. I travel between here and Techix. Sometimes they even make it up to the resistance camp. Isn't that dangerous with the cat all around? I've had a few close calls, but they haven't caught me yet. The stars are on my side. No, let's not jinx it. Let's see what you sell. I'll take a look at your stuff. I might buy something Got from plenty you. Of supplies. Uh, so this is the item she has. We can actually even buy Ungorian's uh, armor as well. We do got a lot of credits, so we could actually buy the set if we wanted to. Mm. The sugar pass would be nice. Uh, yeah, let's uh, oh, let's sell the scavenge. Let's buy the armor. Let's buy that. And let's confirm trade. There we go. Now we got some ongoing armor now. Okay, I think we did what we can here, so it's time we war, war out and hit that labor camp so we can free the ongoing stuck there. I'm reading a temperature decrease. Hold up, we got some more people here to talk to. Can I call to you? To talk? Probably an issue with the de icing system. I'll take a look. Can't talk to her. Yeah, it's not letting me talk to her, so... Oh well, I guess. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Alright, well... At 100%. Let's hop on the Nomad. And let's go for that labor camp. Which is, uh... Over here. 
But it is a memory trigger that will unlock Sam's away right there. It's pretty close, so must well head over there. Yeah, we can head up there real quick. Automated oh, protocols a activated. Forward station. Let's get, have dressed warmer. Let's get that. It's not that cold. Let it go. Are you going the right way? Mm, probably not. Have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. All right, that looks like another cat station. We'll so, might am not I the first and only Asari, you know? Probably don't have to hit you that. You are the first, but not the only. Really? Who else? There is also Lexi. Oh, right. T yeah, I, I take it PB is not a fan of Lexi. Oh, 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 oh. Pathfinder, this area can be Let's launch that resources. mining drill. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Yes. Alright, let's go up this mountain. I forgot how to activate four wheels. I forgot how to activate four wheels. I'll be right back. I gotta check the settings real quick. There we go. Four wheel, six wheel drive, baby. Oh, it's too high. It's too high. Okay, we gotta go in a certain angle. Is it eight wheel drive or six wheel drive? Okay, it's six wheel, so yeah, six wheel drive. So you usually use six wheel drive for you know climbing up mountains. Without kit, the resistance fights so our children may one day be free. They are a tough bunch. How long have the Angara been fighting the Ket? Must feel like forever. Okay, looks like we're in the right there. Yeah, we're in the right direction. Hey. All right, what the hell is hiding right here? What's hiding here, game? There's nothing here. Yeah, there's absolutely nothing here. We're here to get the uh, Sam node right here. So let's grab that. Let's go, baby. Let's activate Sam, that memory. memory prompt. One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Sam node on the Hyperion to investigate further. And we got that out of the way. Now we can hit, hit, hit our way in to the cat holding side. But since along the way, let's head to Soka's nav point for the missing supplier since it's along the way. So let's head over there, shall we? Hey. Oh god. Okay. How good is it to be okay? Your people have been fighting the cat for a long time. Since long before my birth. Are you encouraged that you have allies now? Us, I mean. It's better not to die alone. Yes. Wow. You don't think we can win? This isn't a typical war, therefore winning won't be typical. Yeah, we can kick their asses. Also got some more cat. You know what? Let's hit that cap camp. Anybody home? Signals detected ahead. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, baby. Oh shit. Take him out, shall we? Nope, stop it. Be careful of those, uh, gotta be careful of those one with the fucking. Seems to be gotten shotguns. See ya. Alright, it's time to go loud too. Woo! Shotgun time. Don't you dare do that. Woo! That was close. Dude, that's everybody. Nope, that's not everybody. Up you go. Ooh. Shoop. Not sure what the hell this thing is. Dude, that's everybody. Yeah, it seems about to be everybody. That looks like some sort of cave we can actually go through, actually. Okay, well, I think we should investigate, to say the least. Get all the stuff from the kits. Boom. Seems like we can't scan that. But this looks like something. We actually might have to go in here for the cat holding spot. Uh, let's head on inside, shall we? As in, nope. It's actually nothing at all. 
I thought it'd be a cave, man. I was getting a little bit excited. But that is not the case, sadly. Alright, well, let's roll out, I guess. I'm kind of curious how the maker controls are going to be like in Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Because everybody talked crap and, uh, you know, about the Mako. Me, I don't mind it, but just the way the map was, is that wasn't that, uh, wasn't that well made. So hopefully they made it a little bit better in Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Ooh, look at this, like a little bridge to build. That looks like the, that looks like the supplier. We are nearing the nav point provided by the on Aya. Alright, let's be careful here. We still see some, uh, cat from the distance. Okay, let's see what we can find. Oh, got some, uh, scorch marks. Consistent with cat's Possibly explosion. Cat. Great. Alright. Got some supply crate. Scans reveal these crates contain Angaran weapons. Oh, really now? That's me! Oh, did Sokka not mention he helps us out sometimes? Alright, and there's a body here. Mm, I recognize him. That's oh, Kaldo. Kaldo is dead. Sokka's suppliers. And here's the ambush. Alright, there to come. Oh, there to come, there to come. Yes, let's go, baby. Those guys eat the grenade or chew. Alright, shotgun time. Uh, uh. Woo! Got a couple of guys over there hiding out. Okay, let's take that. Alright, there's somebody, somebody hiding over here. I don't like it. And there's a big ass creature that we're going to have to kill, sadly. Okay, let's not shoot that thing, okay? We don't have to kill that thing, everybody. Here to kill the cat, and that's it. Let's get the supplies and get the heck out. Okay, can we scan this? No, we can't. Let's refill our stuff. Okay, that's the stuff we need. Deliver the weapon to Soka and stuff on Aya. So we just hit back to Aya and give that to him. Boom! We are good. Alright. Now we can head to the cat holding site. And there's also that interference here we can investigate as well. Excellent. Wind around the woozy, I'll call it. Oh, another beacon here. Pee -pee, what do you like to do for fun? Whatever's next. That's what's fun. So there's nothing from your past that you miss? That you left behind? Well, I had a weakness for gruesome crime stories. True stories of the Ardat Yakshi among us. Hm, that kind of thing. Of course, they probably weren't true, but they were thrilling and kept me up at night. Hmm. I'd like to read them. Me too. But when you travel light, you have to leave things behind. It seems like Jaw and people are getting along just well. I like that. I like when teammates are getting well. Get along each other. Jaw is the type of guy you just want to hang out and just chill. But this looks like this is the holding cell we got a hit, so let's be ready to kick ass. You ready to kick ass, people? This definitely is the place. The labor camp Skiot talked about. I'll keep an eye out for the kidnapped Angara. Seems pretty. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! We got people. Woo! Uh. The control panel is right there. Shut this down. Oh whoa whoa whoa! Get the heck out of here, Mister Doggy! Come on! Come on! Hit that! Hit that! Hit that! There we go. Whoa! They got a shotgun that does absolutely nothing. That's some sort of new weapon that I've never seen before. Let's get that. Hey. Alright. Gonna get the shotgun of you. Alright, I'm going straight in. Boom! Wow. Go to NATO Chief. Woo! Things are getting nasty. Hurt. Oh man. Let's go! Got more coming up. Right, let's go. Time to kick some serious ass. Hurt! They don't chew. Uh. Off you go. 
Man, the shotgun. Absolutely disgusting. Okay, we don't got time to read that note. Yes, I will. All right, let's keep freeing this uh, ongoing. Like the sound of that. All right, let's move up. Right, let's switch the long winch. Stop it. Stop it. You did. Okay, I'm gonna stick with the shotgun. Oh! Nope. Let's go, baby. Gotta go. The combo shoot. Woo! Then with the fucking phalanx. He's dead. Excellent. Zoop! The speeders and prisoners so they can help us in the battle. Alright, so we got some more stuff. So like I said, this is a heavily modded gameplay, so there's a lot of mods I'm running. Okay, where's the baddie? What's the oh, there, there he is. You're dead. Alright, now we gotta speak to, to Neji, which is right here in front of us. It's kind of moving pretty fast. Yo, 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 I need to speak to you, friend. Stop. Stop. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Just in time. Ought to given us another day at most. No thanks for Rana's jabs. If the cat can't handle being called mildly insulting things, that's on them, not me. You see what I mean? We owe you. How'd you find us anyway? Uh, Skrill, tell us about you. Your nephew Skiat was trying to get you rescued. Good boy. He's got potential, Nild. As I have said before, the resistance needs to be debriefed. We'll head back to base as soon as possible. The data drive. We have to deliver it to Buxel so she can start the analysis. Interesting. It seems we have to depend on our rescuer for more than a rescue. Can you deliver this drive to Tedjix? If we work together, no time will be wasted. Uh, what is it? What's in the drive? What's in it? The cat code we stole while trying to infiltrate their mm. The cat never. We're gonna need. We're gonna need that. Yeah, we'll do it. Sure. I'll go there as soon as I can. Perfect. Back still will be in her workshop. So we'll have to head back to the I'll research station and give the data drive to her. Whoa! This is big. Liberating key resistance agents and recovering information they stole from the Ket. You've put many doubts about you to rest, Ryder. Even Ephra must now be convinced of your intentions. What about the data drive Nils entrusted to us? Good point. If you prefer, you could go to Tetchix now and speak to Ephra later. The choice is yours. I'll go to Tetchix first since we're out here already, so why not go there first? I need to get this data drive to Tetchix. I can deal with Ephra later. I thought you might say that. Very well. We'll talk to Ephra when you're done with your tasks here. Yeah, we're, out, we're already out here. I don't want to freaking you know, go back and forth on that stuff, so let's get I some of that ammo. Temperature decrease. Okay, let's make sure we explore everything in this area, like that. Scan as much as things as much as possible, that we get some more research points. Okay, let's take a look around our area. So, interference source, so gotta hit there real quick. And then, Terchik is should be over here. That's where we gotta go, right here. We got a lot of hidden catches too to find too. Another forest station, that would be good to hit as well. Yeah, there's a lot of shit. I forgot there's a lot of stuff to do. But like I said, it's definitely a lot better going this planet than Helval because Helval is a lot of jungle. Pretty confusing too to navigate in some areas too. So best to come here so that way things are a lot more simple, a lot easier. Plus the frames too is looking very nice too. But I'm pretty sure once I go to Helval, that's when the frames are going to drop. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Life support is back online. Oh, we got some more update. This is the uh, the intel from the cat. Our attempts to release their repugnant Angurian AI from their frozen city are behind schedule. Archon continues to sharpen it, uh, to capture it and not to destroy it. More slaves are required. The frequency of waves will be increased. That is all. 
So yeah, I knew there was a I knew there was an AI, you know, in this fucking map. Uh, well, in this planet, to say the least, but we have to dig it out, essentially. That's going to be another side mission we'll probably be doing at some point in the game. Uh, it doesn't look, it looks like we pretty much got everything we needed here, so... I think it's time to get the heck out of here. Life support is back online. Okay, Sam, you don't need to tell me everything, okay, buddy? Joel, I heard you singing the other day. I peeked in. You were applying lotion to your neck. Flaps. You're mistaken. About? The singing. However, the daily application of hydrogenated ash salve is important to keep my neck flaps. Getting closer. Oh, I wanted to finish that conversation. God damn it. I, sh I should have just let them keep talking. Anyways, we're here for the source of the interference. What the hell is that? Looks like some sort of probe? This is the source of that interference? Looks like a meteorite. The interference is caused by the EM radiation it's emitting. I detect that. Detect later! Angry Adi, headed for us! Uh oh, 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 that's a lot. That's a lot, that's a lot. Fishmans! Fishmans! Keep all cool. Getting too close. Alright, shotgun time. Uh. Woo! By that meteorite might be drawing the RD as well as driving them into a frenzy. How do we uh, shut it off? Let's scan Perhaps it. Scan will tell us more, Pathfinder. Let's scan it. See what the hell kind of meteorite is this? Pathfinder, I can Strange walk. To dampen the signal. Okay. Can we destroy it? Okay. Guess we're gonna mess with Watch it. I guess. Those Adi seem really mad. Adi don't normally act like this. Some things made them angry. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Got. Uh, we got it. I suggest we return it to the Nexus for analysis. We could learn more about the Scourge. I guess so. True. Disrupting comms, driving wildlife into a frenzy. There's too much here to ignore. We need to study it. It's probably risky. Hopefully the Hajara scientists won't have any more trouble with their comms. Well, okay, the walk just... <laughs> just disappears. That was easy. Alright, so we took the walk. Put it in our ship, hopefully it doesn't bite us in the ass. Cause that might disrupt the, the systems in our ships as well. So hopefully let's see, it doesn't bite us in the ass. Oh, I see a remnant site just up ahead to be. We could head over there. Hmm. Or just head over here to the to Telchik and give the data job to Booksy, which we could actually head to. Oh well, let's head over here to this uh forward station base here. Now we don't worry about, you know, that way we can fast travel. As well as restoring, you know, the life support. The if there's any way we can help the Angara deal with the cat, we're gonna do it. We haven't been able to take down any of their defenses. Many lives were lost trying. Pipi, when Asari exclaim, Goddess, who are they talking about? Me. Obviously. The windows are fogging up on the inside. Isn't there some sort of de-icer? I swear I will turn this car around. <laughs> Everybody just shut the hell up. That looks something interesting. This remnant site has defenses in place, Pathfinder. Yeah, I think I think that's where they're holding the AI, if I recall. The ongoing AI that is deep in there. Deep underground. Yes, I know, we're not going near it. I wonder if we can activate this forest station at least. That way we can fast travel, you know, to place the places. Alright, uh, getting pretty close hey, to Telchik. Uh oh. Uh, Jal? <laughs> Jal? You alive? <coughs> what? <laughs> what did I miss? Uh, the way Ryder drives, you can sleep? This is a very smooth ride. <laughs> Jaw actually fall asleep while I'm driving like a madman. What a fucking true Chad this guy is. <laughs> 
Even people are like, you, you gotta be kidding me. You can sleep while water dries? It's like, it's not too bad, you know. <laughs> hey, can you help me with something? There's a wraith cloaked near you. I lost its movement. Will you scan for it and let me know where it's hiding? Alright. Well, let's see if we can find it. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. I still get chills every time I glimpse one under the eye. I don't see the wave. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. I bet the real thing is breathtaking. I don't see the waves. Are you here to observe the Yavara? What are the Yavara? Walk onto the frozen lake and you'll see them beneath the ice. They've lived on Vold for millennia. Stories about the Yavara are the only Angaran folktales that survived the Scourge. They're beautiful, intelligent creatures. Our closest tie to our past. And there your people will poach them right out of existence. Trouble? Something I should know about? Two dozen Yavara have been killed since outlaws of your kind landed on Vold to hunt. We have no resources to track these poachers and the resistance is spread too thin. At this rate, our only link to our history will disappear forever. Ryder, the Yavara are vital to our current culture. We need to stop these hunters. Okay, uh, we'll do. We'll do whatever we can to help. We should hurry. Uh, going in folklore. You said you have folk tales about the Yavara. Somehow, Yavara stories are the only ones that survive the Scourge. Most of them have the same theme. A Yavara song is so beautiful, it can coax the sun out of hiding, reveal the stars. Just stories, of course, but when your entire history is lost, stories are precious. I see why the Yavara are important to you. To all Angara. They're a symbol of what the Scourge took from us. We can't lose them. Okay. Yavara, tell me, tell more, me more about, about them. The They're amazing creatures able to communicate through intricate songs. Long ago, we could have heard the songs in person. But the Scourge trapped the Yavara beneath the ice. Now we have to settle for static-filled recordings. How do they survive under the ice? No one knows. We've dedicated our lives to studying them, and we still can't find the answer. They're cut off from food and oxygen, yet they still persist. My colleague here has a theory they may be remnant. We have no way of confirming this, of course. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, if we can hear the sounds coming from under the ice, it sounds pretty damn terrifying. So there's a cloak... There's a cloak fucking uh, wave somewhere. There isn't a slice on both sides from nice But things. where? There's gotta be one out here somewhere. Alright, well, we're going in, guys. We might be able to see it under the ice. Kinda terrifying hearing the noises. Alright. Okay, we can see it. Vaguely. Looks like a Kadulu. Alright, Mr. Wave, where are you hiding? Oh yeah, found you. Over here. Nice. Been tracking that thing all day. Thanks for the help. Do I get to meet the mystery sniper? <laughs> Only right. Come find me. It's gotta be over there. <laughs> all right. Well, we can see the, the weird things below the ice, so they're definitely down there. The Yabare look like octopus, to say the least. Well, there's the sniper. You, sir. There you are. Nice shot back there. Thanks. My father taught me as soon as I was old enough to hold a gun. Good to you on our side. I'm glad I'm not on the business end of that thing. As long as you're not cat, you're safe. Okay, so let's talk about Remnant. You ever shoot Remnant out here? I don't see them too often. I heard there's a big one somewhere, but I never found it. Okay, let's talk about the cat. Do the cat come around here a lot? Only some. Resistance patrols keep most from getting through. I pick off the stragglers. Usually wraiths like the one you helped me with. You ever miss one? Miss? Never. <laughs> Is that miss? Hell Zero. no. I never miss. But well, here we go. Completed that quest. 
The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Yes, Sam, I know. Thanks, Mom. Oh, Daddy, I guess. Yeah, that looks crazy looking. Definitely look like octopus or whatever they are. Alright. Let's head inside to Tetrix and Tetrix. We should speak to Boxel about her brother as soon as possible. And of course the data drive too that we got.